We want to thank all of you for your help for the St. Luke programs. And for us, the uh, mission here is very vital, not only for us, in order to fulfill the Lord's command to go to all the earth with the good news, and also to fulfill the command of the church, which is to bring love where it is most needed and where it's most difficult to bring it, and also to fulfill the injunctures that faith without works is totally lifeless, and also to be able to work in a way that that restores to people dignity which is God-given. It's not a gift of some paternal structure, but rather recovering the dignity that is God's gift for all people. And so we do this by completely empowering the people who are here and not overrunning them, overriding them, importing ideas, uh, but rather following their dreams and visions and the ways that they see how to make things happen. We do it with uh, looking for every self-sustainable way that we can in agriculture and with having people participate even minimally in supporting a mission that's helping them. We do it also by uh, do, trying to do everything local, buying local products, using local uh, people to build for us, and having a completely local staff, 100% local staff. Uh, we do it in all these ways, trying to seek support here in order to try to make as independent as possible the mission. We'll never succeed as long as our population is poor people, that's for sure. We'll never, we'll never succeed. We all, we'll always need, uh, in Creole they say subvention, uh, we need to be subsidized. And unless we decide to change our target, we could manage never to be subsidized. But I think we all agree if you're targeting people who have nothing, what they have to give back financially is almost nothing, and yet what they have to give back in terms of witness to faith and determination to live and respect for life and a real strong desire to fight to make things better, you know, when they give that back, of course, that's that's priceless, but uh, that doesn't pay for diesel and it doesn't pay for expensive medicines like cancer medicines, so we will always need to be subsidized. So we're very grateful that you have it in your heart and have it as part of your own Christian witness and Catholic witness to support us in, in our undertaking. Can we solve the problems of the country? No. Can we solve the problem is a vast percentages of people here, no. Uh, can we make a difference in individual lives, yes. Can we make a difference in neighborhoods, yes. Can we make a difference in communities, yes. And at the end of the day, as long as we said, I did everything I could today, Lord, uh, please bless it, that's, that's all that's required. So thank you very much for your help and God bless you and please come and visit us.